everyone and welcome to another vlog. We're at Gapton Retail Park in Great Yarmouth and we're going to look around a few stores. We've got the girls with us and they have a request. They want to go to a store where they have mini trolleys. So we're going to be going into Boots first. We're now in Boots and they no longer have the little trolleys. They have these like half size ones. So they're just going to have to make do with one of those. Now in the hair section, I've just spotted these half price on Garnier Ultimate Blends and their hair masks. Look how big these are. You can get banana, aloe vera, coconut, papaya, and they're down from $6.99 to only $3.49. Boots currently have a baby event and they have biodegradable baby wipes and you can get a pack of four for only £2.75. The thing with shopping with kids, to keep them happy, just get them like a little trolley or a medium sized trolley. They'll let me walk around here for about half an hour and not say anything. Molly, your hair grows so fast. We're going to have to get your fringe cut next week. Holly just pointed out all the Yankee candles are now in security cases and they're custom built ones. Do you reckon that's because it's run up to Christmas and they're more likely to get stolen? Oh yeah, they get did you know there was someone in Home Bargains in I think it was Fetford stole a hundred pounds worth of candles. A hundred pounds worth of candles. In one go or repeated trips? I'll put her picture because they got a picture of her. So if you know who this woman is, she's wanted. But yeah, that's the reason you need things like this. That's madness. Just make a correction there, it was actually B&M, so if you know who this woman is. It's a really bad picture. You'd think they'd have a good CCTV camera, because if anything gets stolen around here, the pictures are really good. But £100 worth of candles? How the hell did she do that? How did she carry them? She must have put them all in the trolley and just walked out. So security heard us talking about candle theft, and now they're following us down every aisle. <laughs> If you're looking for a unique face mask, they have Simpsons ones and they're £4 each, but they are in free for two. If you like Spectrum brushes, they have an Aladdin set with Jasmine on the front and they also have Snow White. Very pricey at £45 each, so hopefully these will be in the 50% off on Boxing Day. Because I do love Spectrum brushes, just unlike the price. Just found this key ring and I think it's adorable but it's really pricey at £8.50. It actually matches Molly's top. Oh and Bella's found one too. Next stop is TK Maxx. We're just looking in the makeup section and I said that's a bit overkill isn't it? Look at the size of the security case for this Bare Minerals palette. It's a eyeshadow palette and it has 14 rose inspired shades and the retail was 39 but it's 24.99 maybe they get a lot of those stolen but if you do like elf cosmetics this is a bargain 9.99 for two palettes if you use natural deodorant they have quite a range in tk maxx starting at only 2.99 i didn't know they had a dental section and they have ultra dex products in here and these are really super expensive these were recommended to me by my London dentist because if you didn't know, my top teeth are veneers and a toothpaste at my dentist would cost about £8 but it's £2.99 in here and you can get this set for only £7.99 You can also get a range of bamboo toothbrushes starting at £3.99 but they're all wrapped in plastic I know a few people might comment, why do I have veneers if I'm a money saver? A lot of people don't know this, but when I was 16, I was attacked and I had every bone in my upper jaw broke, so I had to have veneers to fix it. Still not perfect though. They're still not perfect, they never will be, but that's why I have veneers. I did have a request to show some mustard colored handbags and they have quite a few in here. Let's have a look at the prices. So this one is, $24.99, which is quite good for a backpack style. That's $24.99. Yeah, you might be better off getting the bigger one. And they have some Steve Madden ones down here. And this one is $34.99. And this one is $29.99. I fancy for that cheap. $89.99. What is £170? What? Who would 
Why do you need to spend £90 on a handbag? Well, if you're really into fashion, no, it's a good there investment. Is no reason to spend £90 on a bag. Do you know what? If I did win the lottery, I would buy myself a Louis Vuitton bag. Well, yeah, some of them are investment pieces. Yeah. But. Nah. But I'd have to win the lottery to justify that spend because oh, I've yeah. always said, right, as a, like when I was a kid, oh, I love Louis Vuitton. And I don't know why everybody's so into Gucci because I just don't see it. But I just love Louis Vuitton suitcases and stuff. I'll take a paper bag. <laughs> yeah, you'll take a bin bag. Yeah. If you're old school and you like watches, I've just found these Just Folk ones. And they're only at 12 99 Retail price is 40 that's a real stunning design. And they also have Kath Kidson watches. These are really pretty. And these are $24.99 each. And they have quite a few designs to choose from. But if you don't want to leave the house, they actually sell them on Avon.com as well. I think they're on offer for £28. And they also have a Radley watch coming for £50. Because I do like Avon. In my last vlog I featured some Teddy Bedham which was really popular, a lot of you went out and bought it. But you can get these, which are basically fleeces, which are very similar, and these are £16.99 each. Just spotted these long sleeve Christmas tops and you can choose from this cat design. They also have this Father Christmas one, but my personal favourite is this. I think it's adorable. Can we go back to the Santa one? Is he dabbing? He's dabbing. And if you're wondering, these are $9.99 each. This is such a unique gift for a photographer. It's a lens coffee cup. Look at the detail on that. That's amazing. Just bought a disc two pack of Harry Potter drinking glasses. Only $3.99. I'm obsessed with Ugg style boots and they have these guest ones for $39.99 and they're super high quality. They also have these ones for $39.99. What make are those? Wrangler. They're so nice. I hope they have them in a seven because my Uggs I've got at the moment, these are, well, they're not Uggs, they're pixie boots, but they're, you know, slouched down. You know how Uggs go after a while? They are about five years old. I could do with a new pair. Um, yeah, basically the back are collapsed. So I hope I find these in a seven. Have you seen behind you? They are. <laughs> Off she goes. I'm in my element. All the Uggs. Feel like a proper fashion vlogger now, look. Even though you haven't tucked my socks in properly. Callum's just spotted these adorable Zara kid slippers. How much are they? Three ninety nine. Three ninety nine. That's amazing for Zara. Yeah. What size are they? I kind of want to get them for one of the kids. Size six. Ah, oh, too small. Well, this is six years old, so I don't know oh, how it translates. They might fit Bella. Why haven't they got more than one? That's the thing with this shop, isn't it? Bella, give me your arm. Oh, Callum measures shoes by yeah, um. Too small. Because if you didn't know, from your wrist to your elbow is how big your foot is, and I can prove it. Right. That's how big my foot is, yeah. Callum, really, inside the store. See. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sitting here in these Ugg style boots because Callum's going to have to pull them off me because I can't bend down. I think I'm going to buy them. Let me know in the comments below if you think I've made a good choice. They are super comfy. $39.99. Bella's just found these Barbie shoes and they fit her perfectly. They're really sparkly, but we don't know how much they are. So we're going to have to take them to check out and see. Callum actually found the tag and they're reduced to £10, so even better. You can have those, Bella. Bella's finding loads of really cool footwear today and these Ugg style boots are by Miss 60. I used to love Miss 60 when I was a teenager and they're only £14.99, so you can have those too, Bea. Yeah, but there's not a lot of space for my foot. Oh, if there's not a lot of space, then... We take them off and put them back. <laughs> yeah, we take yeah, them off and put them back. We found the Miss 60 ones in Bella's size, so we're going to be grabbing these. I can't believe they're only $14.99. Molly's just found these boots what fit, and they're very glittery, and they're by Juicy Couture. And these ones are 25 Yet another brand name, which was really popular in the 90s. 
Well, this vlog has taken a turn. Come in for a browse, end up spending over £100. On shoes? Yeah, I like these ones better though than the juicy ones. Yeah? If you're wondering, these ones are 19 99 So cheaper than the Juicy Couture ones and a lot nicer. Gonna do a little shoe haul here. We've got the guest ones for myself. Got these Barbie ones, which are £10 for Bella. The Miss 60 ones for Bella. And these ones for Molly. Just found this in the clearance section and it's 16 99 and it's super soft. I'm not sure what size it is though. Oh, it's a large. I actually need a dressing gown for my hospital bag, so I'm trying to do one. I think the leopard print one's a bit too daring. I do love it though. But this one is a cloud print design. So let's have a look. And this one's in a medium. I don't know. I look like a tent. <laughs> a what? I said I look like a tent. Oh, this one's $19.99. Yeah. Oh. Look, you can camp under there. Ten. So after trying on four or four different ones, you're settling for the cloud. Yeah, I think the cloud's quite nice. It's kawaii. Kawaii? The girls want to go upstairs and look at baby stuff, but for their dollies, not for baby. But I do need to buy a few things, actually. Definitely going to get this one for my hospital bag. The only thing is, though, yeah. I'm a bit concerned when they take the security tag off, there's going to be a hole in it, because sometimes that happens. We'll see. Yeah, it's the only one they have as well. If you like accessorise, they have quite a few hats in here for four ninety nine. This is a really pretty one. And they also have this fleecy one. Yep, don't leave yourself behind, Holmes. I'll waddle in. Waddle, waddle. Great, are we going into one? Yeah. We're now upstairs and we're looking at the kids' coats and they have a range of Michael Kors ones and these are $49.99 each. I think this one is adorable. I can't justify spending £50 on a kid's coat though. Nope. In the baby section, they've got matching cloud dressing gowns and this is for age 12 to 18 months and it's 7 99 so it's a bit big for our baby but super cute and they've got all these sets which are super cheap look 9.99 what's this one this one's got flowers on it look it even comes with a free gift bag how good is that that is so good because we actually have to buy some gifts so if you do see different sexes in our trolley is because I have a friend who's having a boy and a friend who's having a girl. Callum's just found a real awesome sleeping bag. Look at this. It's a pirate one. 18 to 36 months that one. I think that's awesome. I love it. <gasps> Look at this. Oh that's cute. And this one's $14.99. Very autumnal I, isn't it? Yeah I love the baby stuff in here. It's adorable. Look, lots of clouds. <laughs> They're just floating around everywhere. Yeah. They have some adorable blankets in here. Look at this. How sweet is this? And it's seven ninety nine. But I'm trying to work out what this is. It's in the baby section, so I'm guessing it's a changing bag. But it looks like a lunchbox. I guess we just have to open it and have a look and see what's inside. It's nineteen ninety nine. Does it unfold into a changing mat? Maybe? Oh, it's a booster seat, so it's not a bag whatsoever. It's one of these things what you take with you, like on holiday, and it'll change into like a booster seat, so you can put them. Say you're going to a restaurant or something, you can just take it with you. That's handy, but we don't need one of those for a while. I'm getting right in here, you know. Oh, broken now. <laughs> I'm getting right in here to get the bargains. What's this one? Well, that's a Grove blind. Um, that's basically one of the blinds that you put up, so say you're staying in a hotel or something. Yep. It blacks out. Oh, that's cool. But these are cheap on Amazon before. Oh, same price as what they were on offer at Amazon, so $19.99. Yeah. We're now in the toy section and I've just found this grand piano concert set for Sylvanian families and it's $12.99. Very sophisticated. I didn't know you could get WWE girl dolls and they're $9.99 each. 
I've just found this best way. It's a paddle and pull slime bar and it comes with powder which turns the water into slime. And these are normally really expensive. It says the retail on here is $32.99 and that actually is that on Amazon. It's in the clearance for £7. How good is this to put away for a present next summer? It's definitely worth checking out the clearance section because they have Playmobil in here for only £4. This is going to cost us a fortune. We're now in the homeware section and look they have banana trees and these are 6 99 In the skinny syrups range they have this pumpkin spice flavour foam topping for 4 99 They also have this coffee syrup set for 6 99 which is pumpkin caramel, pumpkin cinnamon roll and pumpkin caramel. Callum thinks this would make a nice gift for someone for Christmas. It's a hot drink set and they have double chocolate, caramel delight, gingerbread and loads of other flavours including s'mores and it's 6 99 They also have this hot drink mix and it's the North Pole Station Drink Express and they have gingerbread, peppermint, salted caramel and milk chocolate and this is 6 99 they have lots of mug gift sets. They have this Kit Kat one, which is $6.99, I believe. They also have this double chocolate unicorn set, which is also $6.99. And up here, they have this Llama hot drink gift set, which is $4.99. So if you know someone who likes llamas, this would make a great gift. So we're now at checkout and we just spotted this wrapping paper and look how much you get in there. Sounds about right, stay in the store until it closes. <laughs> but if you're wondering how much these are, they're $5.99 a roll. £153.12p. Ouch! We're now finished in TK Maxx. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, comment and subscribe. And until next time, we will see you soon. Bye!